simulation. As you can see, there are different kinds of pulley setups here. So the pulley system is how you can change the setup that you're going to be using. And the, the, actually, the pulley setup systems that we're going to be using will include the single fixed, the single compound, and the double compound. So those will be the three that we're using. Um, and if you go through, you can actually change the different angles, the side angle, things like that. So I'm just going to put it as a side angle for right now. If you look at the single fixed, you can see that we're going to try to take our pulley here and move our pulley uh, a certain distance above by going and applying a force. So what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to move this pulley, which you can see over here, the load, the weight of the pulley is 5 newtons, and the distance we want to lift it is going to be 0.1 meters. So in order to get it moving, um, you're going to want to go over here to the, the force applied, pull it up to the top, and you can see that then the pulley is moving downward. It moves the point um, 0.1 meters, and it shows you up here that the distance pulled is going to be 0.1 meters also. So once again, if you want to see some of those things, you can see the distance pulled is able to be marked over here on the measurement side. And um, you can see that those are the values that you're going to be able to work with. So distance pulled, you see over here that that's this value. You can go and change the pulley setups. And every single time you do this, whenever you're going to go in and reset this, you're going to actually go through, click on this little bar, pull it all the way up to the top, and release the force applied. And then you're able to have it, have it play, play out from there. So always take your force applied, pull it up to the top, and you're going to use that in order to go and collect the data for each of the setups.